What's happening Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. Another wireless headset to check out. Hey, I wanted to check this out. It's Ribbo X wireless headphones. I thought they looked pretty cool and they weren't that expensive. And I thought, you know, if they're pretty decent headphones, you know, these could be a great set of headphones to put in your little day pack or at your office, you know, you hit the road, be able to listen to music, podcasts, those types of things and have some style and yet to have you know, a good audio experience without breaking the bank. Uh, what else do we get in this box? So we get all your kind of natural cordage, which I'm actually impressed with this cord. This is a uh, kind of a controller cord. Looks like we have an inline microphone and a mode button there. This is all white braided nylon, which is nice. Three and a half millimeter, three pole and four pole. And the four pole is a 90 degree bend. And then right here we have the ubiquitous uh, micro USB charging cable. Looks like we have some instructions here. And then here are the headphones themselves. And so this is really what I wanted to check out. Now I ordered these in white because they were available in white and black. And I have tons of black headphones. I really just wanted to try something else that was a little like more stormtrooper-ish and brighter. Uh, all plastic construction up here. And you can see here that uh, you've got a pretty stiff little joint there. You can even see the little braided wire in there. Um, but, you know, when it folds up, what you can see is you get a nice little compact state. But let me open that up. We have a silicone band up here. It is padded, so that should be kind of comfortable. And WT8S. Um, you kind of have like a, it's all plastic construction, but you have a nice little chrome-like finish down here. All this is plastic, white plastic. This is plastic too, rebox. It almost looks like this is translucent um, plastic with like a black pa uh, painting or decal on it. So that might even light up if we're, if we're lucky. You can see here we have a couple of on-ear ear cups, you know, a soft pea leather, a right and a left emblazoned on the screens there. So that should be nice and soft. Not big enough to go over my ear completely, but my full ear will fit under here. And then, uh, let's see. Okay, so this is the right side which is interesting because as a right-handed person, you would think that there'd be controls up here, but they're on the left side. And so they will be on the back and you can see here, we have play, pause, power on. We have a mode button right there. Looks like advance, advance, rewind, volume up, down, micro USB, the aux in there. Looks like, I'm assuming that's a microphone hole, an SD card slot, a little light. So if I just hold this down, so we can get this thing to power on, there we go. There's that light, Ooh, look at that. Oh, there we are, translucent. I told you, I told you. You might not have listened to me, but I was right. That's kind of cool. That is a really cool look. Actually, I'm impressed by that. Now we've got the blue and green blinking here, which means we're in pairing mode, I believe. So I'm just gonna pair them up and try them out. All right guys, so I've been uh, listening to these, playing around with them. First of all, you can see how they fit here. They're obviously adjustable, so they fit even my big head. So if you are a normal person, you are going to be able to uh, fit these no problem. Look at this, they're lit up, right? I think they're still showing light, which is pretty cool. They're really comfortable and because they're all plastic construction, and you know, instead of a lot of metal on there, the pro and con is that you get them and you feel like, you know, the audio quality isn't gonna be great. They're, they feel maybe a little bit of cheap, like you kind of an inexpensive build, but the pro of it is, is that they're super light, right? So I have some of the other headphones that are metal construction down here. And they get pretty heavy, especially if you're moving around, like you're on your lawnmower or whatever, you know, that weight kind of starts to weigh on you a little bit. So these are just really light. Now I will say, um, I was shocked at how good really the audio quality was on this. So I was listening to some music, listening to some podcasts, and I was, and it kind of dawned on me, especially when I was listening to a song and it starts out, you know, with a lot of trouble, a lot of mid, which sounded great, you know, the clarity was great, but then, you know, they pound in that bass, like, you know, a few bars in and man, I was like, holy smokes, this thing really does have the bass. Now, I will will say that, uh, you know, the, um, the controls are also really nice. So the cool thing about the volume control is that you tap those buttons. So because they're dual mode, it's tap and then advance the track too. But when you tap it, it adjusts the volume, which I really love because, you know, that's really what you want to do more than anything. And then you'll hold it for the other function. But on top of that, it controls the uh, volume actually on my device or so on my phone, I'm seeing that slider, you know, so a lot of devices seem to have like volume control locally, and then you have to control the volume on your device. I like when it's just one single volume control. 
And now I will say, again, this is pretty inexpensive. You know, they're kind of a no frills headset, black or white, but the audio quality is great. They're super light. They fold up, so they're, they're definitely travelable and you can recharge them with any micro USB cable. Again, it's just one of those things and it's just kind of a cool look, you know? Uh, these, this, this, these lit up ear cups are just, I don't know, they're pretty trick, man. I'm, I'm, I'm digging them. So anyway, listen, if you are looking for a, you know, a pair of inexpensive headphones that work, that you don't have to sweat too much and sound really, I'll be honest, pretty dang good, you know, check them out. I will put a link to these in the description below. Peter Von Panda, out.